Mama, I lost him last night. My son is dead. She succeeded in killing him, like she said. <laughs> It's a child to call my own Whichever gender Whichever color I'll receive it with love Barrenness leave me alone So that tears can dry from my eyes So barrenness leave me alone I wanna be happy with children around Barrenness leave me alone Let me feel what did I go wrong? Yeah. But why? What did I do wrong? What have I done? What have I done that set me gone? Where did I go wrong? I just need a child of my own. That's all I pray for. All I need is a fruit of the womb. All I want is a child to call my own. Whichever gender, whichever color, I'll receive it with love. Barrenness leave me alone, so that tears can dry from my eyes. So barrenness leave me alone. I wanna be happy with children around.
Mike. 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 Killing yourself. Eh? Crying will not solve this problem. Rather, it will cause you problems. Okay? Try and put yourself together, please. Eh? My love, I understand you perfectly well. But I do not wear the shoes and I don't wear pictures before. I know, baby, you're not the only one wearing the shoes. I'm into the shoe, too. Okay? I mean, we're into it together. Not only you, I'm feeling it too. I'm being concerned about this whole thing. Eh? If you wound yourself now, what do you expect me to do? I, I, I so much believe that someday, God will give us children. Okay? We are not God. We are not the maker of children. I know very well that you feel concerned about this, but in situations like this, women feel it most. I cannot sleep. I feel frustrated. I keep having sleepless nights. I'm so bothered, my love. I understand your plight. I understand you perfectly well. Okay? But there are people out there who are in the same problem. But they're not handling it this way. Okay? Let's put our trust in God. Please, let's not just give Satan the, 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 the chance to, 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 to be working in our lives. But for God to bless us, we're not going to continue with this kind of situation, crying all the time. When you complain, Satan will have the chance to, to do his work. But when you give God all the glory, do you understand? Things will start working. At this point, I don't care about anyone. I only care about myself. Look <laughs> at myself. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> like I said before, God will give us children. Okay? Please, stop this. Okay. It's not going to help us. Okay? Come on, yeah. yeah. Get up. <laughs> All right, I'll, make, I'll make you happy now. Okay? <laughs> that's what I'm that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Stop crying, okay? Okay. Is this allowed to be done?
I was in the bathroom. Forgive me, please. Let's go inside. Oh, I'm, I'm very, very sorry. It's my brother at home. Auntie, Auntie, there's no need for us standing here now. Let's go inside. Go inside and do what? What am I going inside there to do? Oh, because my brother is not at home, he don't want to open the door for me, Abby. Eh? But I just explained to you that I was taking my time. Go back to your child. You're telling me about it. Give me an answer. Auntie Lizzie. Listen, Vivian, or whatever they call you, whatever you have done to my brother, it will not succeed for you. Yes, because of you, my brother refused to take care of us. Eh? Please, can, um, can we go inside? Because our neighbors might be hearing our voices. Eh? Hey, you don't want your neighbors to know that you are evil. You are now also. So what? Oh, you are afraid of exposure. Eh? I don't, I don't understand. Vivian! Listen to me. Whatever you have done on my brother, it will not work for you. I repeat myself. It will not work for you, Vivian. It will not work for you. He was my brother before he married you. And he will still be my brother. Or am I the cause of your childlessness? Eh? Please, I can eh? explain. I can explain what. Why don't you allow us to enjoy my brother's wealth? Your only brother. Auntie, please, please, I have been standing here and listening to all that you have said. Please, please, I am begging you in the name of God, do not push me to the wall so that I will not regret my actions. Please, Vivian, why are you singing a Why are you singing a Oh, you did your action. Am I afraid of you? Eh? You need it to me! You need it to me! Anyways, I don't have time to listen to a useless woman like you. One day, all your evil deeds will be will come out in the open. It will come out in the open. Why now, Monsu? How are you? You are feeding all the children in the room. Get your children in there! Good life, you are good for nothing. We need a reason. Take a chop for Maka. Look at that. You are not good. You are not good to marry a big wife. Another one will give us children. Take a chop for Maka. I will go back and meet you. I will go back and meet you. You are not good. I will go back and meet you. Mike, why are you doing this to me? Oh. 
What am I doing to you? You think I do not know? You think I do not know that that, that you've been at the house of that good for nothing girl? That good for nothing girl will be giving to me what you are never to give to me in so many years. That will not be possible. You won't do that to me. You won't do it. Good night, my dear wife. Ma Just so you know, it's my last work. You have to do that to me. Nice to see you. So good to see you, my <laughs> son. Huh? Ah, how are you doing? I'm good. How are the people in the city? They are fine. Hey! Hello, how are you? Hey! 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 In the middle of the week. How is work going? Mama, work is fine. Work is fine. I just went for a checkup and I next week I might not be going to work. So I decided to use the opportunity to come pay you a visit. Your sister Lizzie just left the village a few days ago. And she complained how your wife, Vivian. Treated that when she visited your house. Mama, I've told you times with that number to stop listening to Lizzie. Eh? What is wrong with Lizzie? Mama, you just have to start listening to both sides of the story before you conclude. I am not concluding yet. Okay. But I want to hear Vivian's own side of the story Mama, through you. Mama, I am not Vivian, so I'm the wrongest person to ask that question. Vivian should stop stressing my wife. Eh? She should just mind her own business in her own house. She should face her own house and take care of it and let my wife be. Now please tell her to leave my wife alone. You're talking about your own sister like this? Just because of your life, Vivian? Mama, I, I, I didn't come to the village to have issues with you or to make you angry i'm here to see you please chooks you are not really the true son of your father you used to love every member of your family before but now you are a different person mama, mama. What, sh what has she done to you mama yes our suspicion has been confirmed only god knows what she has done to you and only god Yes, we will not fold our hands and let you degenerate and down her hands like that. Hey. <laughs> hey, that reminds me, Michael. So, what do you make of that uh, manager's uh, proposal that he submitted? Any consideration? Leave that man. That man, that man is not serious. He's, he's talking from the both side of his mouth, you know? I don't see any meaning in him at all. Well, if you say so. Yeah. But, um, um, well, let's just wait and see how things unfold in the next few weeks. At least few weeks is enough of any findings. Hmm. Well, I have better things to do with my time other than to, to line up another man's fantasy. Why do you even think he wants us involved in this whole thing? Eh? When he could easily put it off on his own? Yeah, I thought about it too, but... Um, Left for me, I will just advise you, give you the brighter look. You can tell. Yo, 
you give it a brighter look, like you said. And as for me, I'm a busy man. <laughs> and I have smarter ideas of making money. So that is what I intend to, to, to keep doing. I don't know. You can give it a brighter idea of my man. <laughs> you know, I just believe in taking risks. Great men take risks. Not go take the one I go kill. <laughs> <laughs> we just have to, to give that uh, that contact and uh, propose a brighter way. Because yes, what? it's on you. Mm. I'll think about it. Let's see how it goes. Yeah. Because if there is anything strange to expose before, at least in another one more. That man is not straightforward. It's not. Hey man, you're driving past my home. Woo, 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 woo. Sorry, my man. <laughs> sorry, 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 oh, sorry, sorry. Let me pull over. Sorry. Pull over, man. Sorry. All right. <laughs> How are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> so how are you doing? You guys are looking good. You see, the children are always looking to defraud their father. Yes, you're right. People just want to see me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, how are you children? Good. 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 I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Alright, don't be tired of time. Let me help you too. Alright, let's go. Not my job. Okay. What's wrong? I'm guessing someone spoiled your day. It's okay. I'll just go in there and get you something really refreshing to drink. Oh, you want something to eat? I don't want to drink. I don't want food either. I want a child. Helen, I want children. Why are you sounding like this? I want to walk into this house one day and have children running after me, calling me daddy, daddy. Is it too much to ask? Why are you sounding this way? Because I married you to give me children. But it's not my fault. Prove it. Helen, prove it. You know what, I, I won't take this to heart. I'll let it slide. I forgive you for what you just said. This, this has always been your style. Look, I will never be happy in this house until you give me children. Children. I can see that someone has been rattling. What happened?
Don't worry. I'll fix up whatever it is. Do you want to tell me something? Jane, I want you to bear me a child. Ask me to bear you a child. Jane, I'm okay. Look, I've thought about everything. All I need is your consent. Please. Ordinarily, I should be thrilled to hear such a proposition. I mean, everything is looking like a dream. How do you think your wife will react when she hears this? I can handle my wife. The only problem is you. Please, Jane. Don't misunderstand me. I mean, every woman has fantasies. And being a second wife is not my fantasy. But... I will think about it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Happened so fast. Mike is seriously dying for me. Could you believe we were together in a hotel last night? Mm. And he insisted that we meet again today. Kulibu, why would I? Why? Ah, he had you yesterday night. He wants you again today. Eh? He's now Oliver Twist. That also means that I am in the God's favorite book. Jane, mm -hmm. let this relationship not end on another thing. Why? Because he's married and you cannot match up with his wife's energy. Forget that thing, no. Eh? If what we planned works out for us, I will have the power to match with that is so called wife, woman to woman. Jenny! That is my Clean name. Your mouth. Ah, wait, wait, oh. Now why you stop me? Hey, then move they go, Jerry. I have told you, and that's the only option. Jane, what you're saying is not possible. It is not possible at all. In that case, I will have to go home to my parents. You may go home to your loving wife. Because I can see that you don't mean what you told me the other day. Why are you being unreasonable? Your suggestion it is not as easy as you think. It is not. And you know I want this baby. And you expect me to tell my parents that? I'm sorry, Mike. It's not possible. It's either you marry me, or I will go ahead and have this baby in my parents' house. And then you will have no right over my child. Really? Look, I beg you, Jane. I beg you in the name of God. I want this baby. And you see this thing that you're saying? It's not possible. And then you have to do something. Or are you scared of your wife? Something like what?
ao Maria. Fluffy uh, baby! Uh, <laughs> so you're always running around, eh? eh? It baffles me a lot. Though. Each time I come to your house, you're not always at home. If you want to tell me that I have my number, you don't know that I'm supposed to call you. They eh? move every gist that they do for fun. And be coming down, no. I know say you like money too much. Because you don't know. Normally they keep us in check. Eh? I know. But wait, though. You look, you look very good. Yes, my love. Happy. Baby, give me gist. My dear, it be like say, God, don't open my case file. Uh, uh. There is this thing that is happening in my life, eh? It's happening so fast. Mm -hmm. As if I'm alive in Wonderland. Oh, my ears are already scratching. It's getting too light suspense. Give me gist, eh? Baby girl, this gist I'm about to give to you right now deserves maximum celebration. And to give me gist, you too like suspense. Uh, give me gist. Ah. Hmm. My dear, okay. your baby girl is pregnant. Jay, mm -hmm. what have you done this time? Who is responsible? Eh? Is this supposed to be a good news or sad news? Eh? Who is responsible, Jay? Ha! Well, Mike is responsible. Ha! Jay, mm -hmm. are you that desperate? Eh? They are trying to play a, sec a second fiddle. Eh? You are too sad for that, this game. This game, how good that they? My dear, forget drama. Eh? For your information, I am the first lady. There's no other woman anywhere. Listen to yourself. Eh? You're, you're, you're wicked. But besides though, what did you give him to eat? Ah, I'm not giving anything though. Eh? I, I tell you, say God don't dust my case file now. Mm -hmm. You don't get cautious, this guy. What happened to his wife? The point is that Mike needs children. And I am ready to give him children. Eh? Ha! You better be sure that this pregnancy is for him. If not, the way they will throw you out there. Now you sabi. Rubbish. How do you mean? Now you know. I don't talk Finnish. I don't ever lie to you. Now you know. Hmm. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> Woman, I can see it clearly, very, very clearly. Man, what is it? Your son is in love with a woman, that is why he turned away from you people. <laughs> a woman? Yes. But, but he's married. Of course, he's his wife now. Is this why is it not his wife that has made him not to to take care of us? Is this wife that made him to abandon us now? So good man, what do we do now? Mm. Mm. Woman, you understand the situation. Your daughter in law is the cause of your son's problem. Your son knew what he did with a woman. That is why. He's sick and depressed sometimes. Hey. If the care is not taken, there will be a problem. Hey, man, you because there are no people. What do we do now? Because there are no people. Woman, <laughs> it is you who decide what to do. Then I will do it. That is my duty to do it. Man, we want you to make him, eh, to turn his back on his wife. We want you to make him hate her. Yes, I want you to make you hate her. Yes, and make him to turn back to us, oh, to turn back to his family. Mm. Woman, it's only cost you a white cup and white bedded she goats. White bedded she goats? Where can we find such? You may give me money to provide the materials. How much? Mm. Oh, no, 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 no. Can't run there. I found them on a hash as yours. It's only going to cost you 95,000 naira. Ah, 95,000. Nah, it's not too much. Mama, it's too much now. Nah, how are we going to get that kind of money? 
No amount is too much to save a life. Okay, okay, man. Right here now, we don't have such amount on us. But we shall go and come back some other time. Better woman. Back up. You may not be. Well, you have the money, Mr. Arms. Yes. Thank you. I'm sorry to bother you this afternoon. No problem. I would have asked you to come to the house. But you sounded so serious and uh, urgent. And I believe what you're about to discuss is important. How could you remember the girl I told you about? The one, the one who, who is pregnant for the gym. Mm, yes. Yes. Has she been that? No. Not yet. But very soon, Uncle. I have a slight problem with her. What is the problem? She wants me to get married to her, otherwise I would have to forget claiming the child as mine. <laughs> but she's right. She's right. Uh, I mean she's not stupid. <laughs> In fact, she's better than you are. <laughs> as a smart girl, as a smart person who she is, she wants to be be assured of the future of herself and her child. By the way, what is your problem? The question of this issue. How could you know that may not be possible? Considering the position of my wife. My wife, Helen. Helen. You always talk about Helen. Do you remember two years ago I called you and I reminded you that you are the only male child of your father? And there's a, there's a need to be continuating your father's name and lineage. Did I or did I not, Mike? Uncle Ruby. Good. And the girl is now in need to perpetuate your father's lineage and name. And here you are thinking about her. What is it your problem, Mike? Go and tell this girl that you're going to marry her. How do I communicate this to him without, without hurting my feelings? You got to be right. You will handle that. Hello? Eliza, Mama. I, I'm still wondering what that wicked woman Vivian did to my son, Chukwode. That made him not to have a child and to turn his back on us, we, his immediate family. Thank God. Thank God that the wise one has confirmed what I've been telling you people about that wicked witch. People thought I'm a frustrated woman that doesn't want her sister-in-law to stay in her husband's house in peace. Vivian is nothing but a witch. I want to go. How far about the money? Were you able to get any amount? Mm -hmm. Yes, so Mama, by the grace of God, I, I raised some money. Good. Tomorrow morning, first thing. We shall proceed to Akreka's house yes. and commence work immediately. Not only that, after the work, while we wait for the, the work to take full effect, we'll be doing our own underground work. Yes, yes. so that we will chase that witch out of my brother's house. Ah, she must go. You will call the Oh! Okay, 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 Oh, I not Mm. You must obey the spirit and turn away from your wife and listen to your mother and your sister and your family members. Obey! Obey! Choose! Obey! Obey! Mm. Mm. So shall it be. Mm. <laughs> Woman. Hey, hey. How's it 
do to some kind of thing as you can before you leave. You're welcome once again. Please accept this little collar. Hmm? Thank you, my daughter. You're welcome. Uh, my daughter Helen, please don't go. Please sit down. I am. Um, I hope all is well, Uncle. No, actually, it was because of you I came. Yes, and having said that, um, you must have concluded that the frog doesn't jump around in the afternoon unless something is chasing it. As a sensitive uh, matter in this house, and uh, it needs to be handled so nobody gets hurt. Okay, Agu, you are, you're welcome. But I'm, I'm yet to know what the issue is. Now, in the view of the fact that you have not been able to conceive a child, which I am Mike here, and the only responsible for disowning you. The girl is pregnant for Mike. And in pursuance of the need to perpetuate his father's lineage, it is imperative for Mike to marry that girl. I would like you to consider Mike's position and the fact that he respects your feelings. And that's why he asked me to come and explain these matters to you. Thank you very much, Uncle. Do you have anything to say? I don't. If there's nothing left for us to discuss, can I be excused, please? You can go now. Don't like. It's difficult, I know. She's taking it away. Hmm? If it's only one child, I will be okay. I just need a child of my own. That's all I pray for. All I need is a fruit of the womb. All I want is a child to call my own. Whichever gender, oh. whichever color, I'll receive Thank it with you so me. much. Barrenness leave me alone, so that tears can dry from my eyes. So barrenness leave me alone. I wanna be happy with children around. Barrenness leave me alone. Let me feel the love of a child. Oh yeah. But why, why me, oh, why me, oh? Yeah. Where are you coming from, brother? I'm so sorry. I I've had a very hectic. I've had a very hectic day today. And who was the guy that dropped you? Oh, please, can you just ask me one question at a time? I actually went to the filling station. I've been at the filling station for hours. Can you just stop lying? Choose. Hey, stop lying and tell me. The real thing. Stop giving me that kind of excuse. Because there is no scarcity of food right now. Rather, there was increase in the price, which affected everything. Yes, I know, but there is food. Okay. Now, give me another excuse. Chips, I don't understand. What has come over no, you? Who? I said, who was the guy that dropped off? Maybe. He's a lover. Choose. 
Jukes, like, I don't know what's going on. Like, I, what, what is wrong with you? Are you accusing me of being unfaithful to you? How are you? What is going on? I've been toiling all day. I went to the police station to get fuel, and then this is what you're saying. You are so okay. You couldn't even ask of the car I left at the petrol station because I couldn't get fuel. And then a good man came out to, to, to assist me and brought me home. And <laughs> drop you off home. A man dropping you off home at night. As what? As your brother or what? Is it your brother? Or who to you? What do you want for him? Dropped you off at home in the night. If it was to be his fellow man, is he going to drop the person off? At home? Huh? Okay. I understand. When a man dies in the night, or a lady, maybe one day he will want to know the fitness of the pants and her waist. Jokes. Jokes? This is so disrespectful of you. This is so unbelievable. That you will accuse me your way. Chooks, you are the only man I have ever loved in my entire life. Why would you do such a thing? Why? I know why. I know because I cannot bear the child. I cannot live with you. That is why you are acting like this. I am dropping you off at night. A guy dropping you off. Okay. Good. Don't worry. No. God, why? Why? Why is this happening to me? Yeah. Yeah. If it's only one child, I will be okay. I just need a child of my own. That's all I pray for. The fruit of the womb, all I want is a child to call my own. Whichever gender, whichever Helen, you, you cannot continue crying like this forever. Stop doing this. What do you want from a useless A woman who can't bear your kids. What do you want? Helen, I love you. I love you and I always love you. This child is a different matter altogether. It does not affect the way I feel about you. It does. No, it does not. You went to her and maybe several other women just so they could give you a child. Do you know what I've been asking myself? What did you tell them about this week? I have a wife who is barren. One who can't give me children. <laughs> I have a useless wife at home who can't do anything for me except stop, stop. No, I did not. You have to stop talking like this. Leave me alone. You're my only true love. It's alright. It's alright. Sorry. I'm sorry I'm making you feel this way. I'm sorry. If it wasn't for this child, we would have been here talking like this. No! My baby! No! Same dream. I just this. I just 
you have in this century. I don't choose. Why are you treating me like this? Eh? You no longer want to eat my food. You go out and come back late. No good conversation. You don't look at me anymore. Choose this. If I have done anything wrong to you, please forgive me. It's not my fault that I cannot give you a child, but the doctor said we're both okay, well, good, please don't do this to me, I'm sorry, my love. Um, it's, okay. it's okay, I have to go now, okay? Chief, I'm going late. Chief, please. If it's only one child, I will be okay. I just need a child of my own. That's all I pray for. My own very good people. I welcome you all to the celebration of my wonderful son. Every woman is born in the world. Of course, so is that son. This is how I like it. Thank you. Let me say that again. There is no DNA. No person that gives this child shall ever prosper. Amen. He shall know no evil. Yes. 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 Evil will not know him. Yes. Yes. He shall train his children's children. Yes. Yes. And he shall see them properly. Yes. Yes. And with that, we have come to celebrate. Celebrations will never lack in our homes. Yes. 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 All these and more we are through Jesus Christ our Lord. Yes. 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 Thank <laughs> you. 
What is wrong with you? Why did you allow her to carry your baby? Mama, because she has been helpful. Helpful? I don't trust her. I don't trust her. Don't you know people like that can do anything? She might be up to something. How? How? Did you see the way she was carrying your baby laughing as if she loves him? Eh? Jane, they don't even have sense. Jane! They don't even have anything for me at all. Train yourself. Listen, you don't need to worry. I already made something for you and Jane. Well, as you can see, I have made something for myself and my daughter. You know, I wouldn't want any harm to come to her. Oh, my grandson. Mama, I just... Mama, is the food ready? Yes. <laughs> you know, I wouldn't want you to test the food. Any beautiful <laughs> Sit down now. <laughs> yeah. If it's only one child, I will be okay. I just need a child of my own. That's all I pray for. All I need is a fruit of the womb. All I want is a child. And why are you crying? Nothing of mine. I'll receive it with love. Darling, I'm sorry about it. Jane, Jane, Jane. Can you excuse me? Mama, Mama, can you imagine? My husband won't even ask about Junior. He ignored me for that which I told you, didn't I? But she will not want to save this house. As long as I live here, don't worry. Don't just worry yourself. I have to go. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Don't even think about it. What have I done? What have I done to Jane and her mother that they would not let me have my peace? The continuous ill treatment and humiliation is getting too much. I try as much as I can to be of assistance to them, but they never see anything good in all I try to do for them. Is it because I don't have a child? Am I God? Do I make babies? What did I go wrong? What have I done? I... Helen. <laughs> Helen, you're breaking me. Stop crying. Look, it's just a matter of time. All of this will be over soon. When? When is this time? Because I am tired. This time. Look. You are aware that she's only here because I needed the child badly. Stop crying. I am broken. No! My baby! Hey, what is it? 
Yes. 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 She said she had a bad dream. That's why she's screaming like a little girl. It's not been anybody. Just that. Just that, Mama. Why does that girl like to seek attention? Huh? I don't know. Okay? Don't mind her. Let's go back to bed. Yeah. To school. What is the name of the school? Eh? Easy. Easy Bay. Easy Bay. Easy Bay. Okay. Where is Easy Bay? Why you could not go to school today? You are still going to SZ. Yeah. Which are Jesus? You find Jesus. You find Jesus? Yes. Yeah. What were you going to do? You won't take to God. Hmm? You're walking. Walking where? Look back here. Sand. Sand for. What is it? What are you doing with sand? Hmm? What? On the road. Okay. The road is spoiled. Okay. 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 See your brother before you said they're coming. Mama, let's go inside and we will explain everything to you. Let us talk here, man. Let us talk here. Let me know. How is he doing? Okay, I saw him. Mama, I don't think Akekacham is doing any anything much on them. Huh? Is that wicked fool still living with him? Huh? Mama, she's still living with brother. The problem now is that brother is very sick. Hey, Chimo. What has happened to him again? Mama, I don't know, but he's hospitalized. Then you were there when Akrika said that what the wife did on him is why he's always sick every day. Mama, I don't know what to do. I'm confused. Mama is very sick. Again, I cannot sit here and watch my only son die like a fowl. They can walk up. Again, again, okay? I don't know if you are. I will not. It will not happen. It will not happen. Eh? It will not happen. I will not. Hey, my heart. 
Yes. I've been to the shrine and I didn't see you there. My son is seriously sick and that's why I'm here to know why. Woman, I told you before, he has not said what he did with his wife. That is what brings sickness all the time. The information I got now is that he's seriously sick and he has been hospitalized. I have done all I could. And the wife is still staying with him now. They are living, but they are not living in peace. Thank you. No, I need people. Please, whatever you can do to make him here, please do it because then. Um... Woman, he is the one that caused the sickness by himself. He had a heavy secret with his wife. Secret? Yes. Only two of them knows what they did. <laughs> Mama? Mama, I'm gone. I'm going to the office to give you this food. Elisa, I'm so worried about your sickness. What did the doctor say is the problem? Mama, me, I'm, I'm even tired. The doctor said there is nothing wrong with you medically. That his problem might be psychological. That woman, that woman they call Vivian. Vivian, she is the cause of the problem. So if Vivian will not see Chuck's bed, she will not rest. Mama, my brother will not die. He will not die. Ah. The last time I saw Akrika, Akrika said that Chuck's and his wife has a very, very big secret within them. Secret. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. Help. Neither does it need me. Everybody. I mean, since this fridge was bought, sometimes I fill up the, <laughs> the bottles and everyone drinks from it. I don't make a fuss about it. I don't make a fuss out of it. Why are you angry because I drank the bottle of water and you feel it? Wait, wait. Did you just talk back at me? I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I blame your mother. Who did you wait to go? Please and please, madam, I beg you in the name of God. With all due respect, I will take any other thing from you, but not speaking about my mother in that manner. When you talked about irresponsibility, my mother, I know, will not talk to anyone the way you talk to me. What have I done to you? Are you trying to say that my mother is not responsible? No, 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 no. Jane, just let her be. Leave her alone. I don't blame you. I only blame the man that married you into his house thinking you're a woman. The only thing you can get back at me with is the fact that I cannot conceive. What else? You are asking. What else do you have to say to me? But just so you know, hmm. the same God who gave you a child and made you a grandmother can still take that child away. Don't forget! Is that your prayer? So you want my child to die? That your prayer will never work in Jesus' name, you witch! I am not a witch. It's you. You, it is you who is a witch. You call me a witch. You are the one who is a witch. I will say you call my mother a witch. Don't you know what you are saying? You don't know what you are saying? She has gone outside crying, looking for who to pity her. Let her cry. Let her cry. I'm not happy the way both of you beat up Helen today. What is the meaning of that? Well, she shouldn't have insulted my mother. How did she insult your mother? How? My son, <clears throat> look, you know I won't lie to you. 
I will tell you exactly what happened. <clears throat> Helen said since my grandson came to this house that she has lost her place in your house. She also said that she wished the child would die. I am not trying to caution her. Before you know it, Helen started insulting me. She started calling me a witch. So I couldn't bear it. So they started fighting. If anything happened to my baby, I will hold her responsible. Helen said this. This was about my son. Mike, Helen said this and she even said more. <clears throat> Lucy, how do you go between you and shoes? My dear, I am tired of everything. And I don't think I can continue with this. Where she is? Do you know how much he has spent on me? Just for a child. Still, I can't get pregnant. I sleep with these guys countless times. Still, no pregnancy to show for it. Does it mean his razor is not sharp enough? Or the Baba is not good enough? Hmm. Or my womb is not working? But some bought me. I'm simply tired. And I don't think I can continue doing this. What well, is your life? My dear, I pity that guy. He has really spent enough money for me just to have him a child. Oh, well, God knows the best. So back to business. Tell me, when will you come back to our usual sports? Huh? Usual sports? Mm -hmm. My dear, I have to think about my life first before any other time. And I don't think I'm coming back to that world. Are you serious? Yes, sir. Okay, I have to go now. Thank you. Please don't touch my baby. I beg you, don't touch my baby. Leave my baby alone. Leave my baby alone, I beg you. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh. Mama, I lost him last night. My son is dead. <laughs> she succeeded in killing him, like she said. Please, please, 
a child to call my own, whichever gender, whichever color, I'll receive it with love, barrenness leave me alone, so that tears can dry from my eyes, so barrenness leave me alone, I wanna be happy with children around, barrenness leave me alone, let me feel what did I go wrong? But what did I do wrong? What have I done? What have I done? I said, Be God. Where did I go wrong? I just need a child of my own. That's all I pray for. All I need is a fruit of the womb. All I want is a child to call my own. Whichever gender, whichever color, I'll receive it with love. Barrenness leave me alone, so that tears can dry from my eyes. So barrenness leave me alone. I wanna be happy with children around. Barrenness, leave me alone. Let me feel the love of a child. Oh, yeah. But why? Why me? Oh, why me? What are you still doing in this house? A child you cannot give us. One as you don't even have. Eh? Mama. The way you talk to me about this child matter is so unfair. If I was your daughter, would you be saying all of this? What is it? You can never be my daughter. My daughter can never be a barren woman. God forbid. And then allow God to do what pleases him. Okay, Nekwan. Go and undo whatever you have done to my son and allow him to have a child. Me? Me, Vivian, I should go and undo what I did to your son, like I did everything to your son. Eh? He should be the one to find out what is wrong with him. Because when I went to see the doctor, the doctor confirmed that I am okay. I am not a barren woman. So go and ask your son what he did to himself. So you are the one who has been eating up the one children in your room. Because my son is so fertile. If you cannot give us a child, leave this house and let a woman that will give us a child come in. Lies! Are sick, lies from the pit of hell. Look, I built this house with Jews when he had nothing. I know how I suffered, I know the sacrifices I made to build this house with him. I am not leaving this house. I will be the last person to leave this house, Mama. Please, I don't need to preach. What is it? Huh? I pity my son who is still wasting his time on you, knowing that you are not a real woman. I will advise him not to to waste his time on you anymore mm. in search of children. Yes. Advise him very well not to waste his time. 
Because have you asked your son why he goes about paying girls to conceive for him and they cannot even conceive for him because he does not have a wife who where is his penis? Leave me alone. Tell him to let of his penis very well. He should choose it inside so that he can have the child. Allow him to You only want to I will not leave this house. We put it together. I will not leave. Come and carry me. Look at that. Obviously, you don't know how to tie it. Give me, let me help you out. And then you can die and rest. Yes. Then we'll start planning for your funeral. Go on. Kill yourself. So you can die. What are you doing here? What are you doing in my house? Eh, hey, madam? Who kept witch like you? <laughs> if there's anyone that is a witch here, it is you because you are a white witch. That's what you are. What is going on here? Eh? Hey? What? What? Mama, look at this thing. Asking me what I'm doing in my own brother's house. Can you imagine? Mama, can you imagine this white witch asking me what I am doing in my husband's house? What are you doing here? Nonsense. Vivian, would you leave my son alone? Do you want him to die in your hands? Have you two done enough? Huh? Eh? Eh? Have you two done enough? What is it? Have you two done enough? Have you two done enough? Have you one of you are ought to leave this house. Yes! You should give us peace in our house! What's your problem? You're talking nonsense. In my own son's house? In my son's house? Eh? I don't blame you. We know you are the reason why there is no child in this house. Hmm. Infer woman. Oh. Rich! That's what you are. I see. Look at you talk to my brother. Uh, Look at my brother. Mm. Look at you talk to him. Mm. Oh, I see. It's about childlessness. I can see it. <laughs> Have you asked him why he has not been able to impregnate a woman? Have you asked him? So if I cannot give him a child, is it not his mates that, that are going outside to impregnate women? Vivian. Vivian, oh, now. Be careful of what you say about my brother. You better be careful of what you say about my brother. Be sure you say that. Oh, I am sorry. Forgive me. He is my husband. Be cool. Don't be offended. 
I mean, we have been all through the whole shame and agony of childlessness. Have you asked him why he goes about paying girls for them to get pregnant for him? What? Have you? What? I've seen what? You're talking nonsense. I'm talking rubbish. Nonsense! Ask yourself! Hmm. What is she talking about? Eh? What is she talking about? You're in the market. You will not succeed. Evil witch. That is what you are. Evil witch. <laughs> You know, you mean this has been happening in that house and you didn't tell me. And you were saying me all this time you didn't mention it to me. I thought it was going to stop. You thought what? They wanted to kill you and you sat there, you were thinking. Now look at. At the end of the day, they framed you up of killing their son. Anyway, that is in the past. Let's start with the present. But I am worried about this your continuous nightmare. I think it has something to do with what is happening. Yes. Don't worry. I will take you to somewhere tomorrow. If it's only one child, I will be okay. Ah, once again, you're welcome to my office. Ah, Sister Mary, please kindly of get my hand to the Thank you. clear revelation. And of course, my God is never an author of confusion. Please, can I ask you some few questions? Go ahead, Pastor. Have you carried out any sacrifices that has to do with blood before? Mm, no, I, I haven't. So, uh, have you had any blood oath with anyone before? I mean, blood oath. No. It's... 
place. What took you so long? I stopped by to do something. I thought you would like it. All this for me? Yes. My goodness. This is too much. Thank you so much, babe. Thank you. Hey, darling. I'm not even more for darling. Okay, go for your upkeep. And I've sent your scoopies to your account. I'm sure you'll see it soon. Don't worry, have it. Thank you. My God, we bless you. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Thank you. I would not have done without you. Okay. You're one in a million. It's okay, babe. Thank Don't you. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Come, let me go get you something. Okay? Come, let me go get you something. I've done without you. You sponsored me through school. You gave me everything I wanted. I promise to always remain grateful for the rest of my life. You made me achieve what no one could help me achieve in this life. Even in your disposition, you still find a helpless poor girl like me ready to go to school. Chooks, thank you very much. And I love you. My love, yeah. it's okay. I know it's not very really easy, but I'm happy we made it through. It's God who provided all the necessary resources to make sure you came out in a fine color. When are you going for your national service? Mm, I'll be going for my orientation first. And that should be in a month's time. Okay, good. I've been wanting to ask you something. What's your immediate plan now that you have graduated? My plan is to get a good job. Then get married to you. <laughs> and build our home together. I'm happy for you and I'm happy for us. I'm more happier. <laughs> Um, please, can I make a request? What's it? Um, were you obliged to eat? Sure, babe. You know I can do anything for you. Can you accompany me to see my mom? My sister Nika called and she told me that my mom was rushed to the hospital. Of course, I will. Okay. Sister, how is she? Hello. Huh? We're in God's hands. Hello. <laughs> you're welcome. Um, Helen, hmm? let me rush to the doctor to know what the previous one had done. Okay. okay. Which word? That word B, the second door. B? Okay. Darling, yeah. Here, please. Okay. Here, please. Alright. Mama, what of you told me that you are not feeling fine? What is this, Sister Mecca? You really inform me that this is getting serious. Why, Mama? Why? This is very wrong. It's very wrong. 
I don't like this. I don't like it seriously. You are sick and you couldn't even tell me. You could not even sister Neka. Thank I'm tired. I've tried what I could to rest the money. I could do the case. There's 8,000 naira. 28,000 for what? Huh? For treatment, of course. The doctor said that I'm out to get received the money. 300,000 naira. 300,000 naira? Yes. Where? Where are we getting the money? 300,000 naira? To the office. I prayed, I prayed, I prayed, I prayed to you, to you, to you. I mean, I don't know what to do. It's fine, I don't know what to do. Because someone take me to the doctor, I need to talk to you. Good brother, he will not listen to me. He will not listen to me. <laughs> let me try, please. Let me see you first. Please. I insist. Hey. Come on, what is it? What is wrong with you now? What is it? Why are you feeling back now? You're getting better. You're getting better. Maybe you should tell me something. What did the doctor say? Hold on. He just cleared the bills. Who is he? He. He. Tell me your place, thank you. Baby. You get everything. Oh, oh God. <laughs> It's okay, it's for mom. It's for mom's health. Thank you so much. It's really hard to get without. It's okay. Thank you. It's okay, man. Thank you so much. It's for mom. Thank it's you. Mom. 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 It's okay. It's for mom. 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 Mom.
lying. Mm -hmm. You've prayed enough. God knows best. He knows why he had to take my life by this time. After all our efforts, I'm still there, no fan. No father, no mother. I'm a smart man. I'm a smart man. I'm a smart man again. After all the money we paid for our hospital bill, everything is in vain. Everything. At least there was money to treat her. What if there was no money and she died because there was no money for our treatment? Yeah? It's okay. Okay. Mama! Mama! Mama, where are you? No, I'm going to see me! Come on, mom, go for me! I'm tired! I'm tired of this life! I'm not going to see me! I'm not going to see me! My love, please take it easy. God knows why. Chips are all alone now. No father, no mother. No mom has left me. I'm alone. Chips, please. Promise me you won't leave me. Please. I don't have any other person in this world. My love, you still have me and Auntie Mika. And I promise I will stand by you forever. No matter anything, I'll be by your side. I love you. I love you too. Please stop crying. <laughs> no, it's okay, please. Please. Sure. Sure. Please, my love. Everything will be alright. Okay? <laughs> love you. Let this blood bind us together. And together we shall live. Let none of us ever find peace apart from each other. And there shall be no life without us being together. Now we have done this. The speaker of Paris. Let's go.
give way to me. What is the matter? Just wait for my hand. No, no. Remember the Habali said we should keep it safe, just in case any of us change our mind. But we're not going to change our mind. That is just the fact. Come on, babe. Babe, come on, stop. What do you mean? We're not going to change our mind. We're not even, we're not even going to break the oath. No, we can still keep it. You're not keeping anything. Come on. You don't need this. Please go. We're not going to break the oath. Please go. Hmm. This is terrible. So how come both of you got separated? Which puts you into this mess, Sister Helen? After living with Chooks for a couple of months, one day I came home to the greatest surprise of my life. Can I have the fat, please? What's going on? Why are you taking our properties to? My love, please, I need you to calm down, okay? Um, I, 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 I'm going to explain some things to you and I want you to understand me and please. Just, what's happening? You didn't tell me you were moving out. So I, I signed a loan and office for someone, but the business or the deal didn't click. The home money was gone, and the bank just came after me and they want to put their money back, taking care of our properties and all that. Please, I'm so sorry for the embarrassment. Why didn't you tell me? Babe, I, I didn't want to hurt you. I didn't want to upset you. I was, I, was, I was trying to see if I can do this whole thing by myself. And Can I have the khaki, please? Huh? Yes, the khaki. Yes. Can you give him the key? Yeah. I'm taking the car also. Jesus Christ. Um, Sam. Sir, please, I... I need to quickly get to the car to get some of my stuff. I'm just coming from the market. I still have some things in the trunk. Okay, let's go. I am burning down your borders. You keep asking why. Why me oh, let we come like fire, burning down your borders. You keep asking why, why me oh? Got another vice for lovers. Cause you wanna prove yourself to your lover. Don't try blood covering. I'm going to see my sister Nika. I'll see you when I return. Don't you dare walk out on me. Don't walk out on me. Where are you going to? I just You're said. going to sleep with men, right? And you think I don't know? Hmm. Chicks, you're the only one I've been sleeping with. You're my husband that you know. It's why don't you? Get him out of Oh, you think I'm a fool? Huh? Ah, I think I'm a fool, right? Sleeping with me. The best thing you can do for yourself is to stay away from alcohol. You've been drinking so much of late that you've become a total different. You're a different person. What is this? Why would you accuse me of sleeping with other men when you know that is not true? You know what, 
But I really don't have time for this. I kept something for you in the kitchen. I'm going out. I found you too. I am talking to you as my wife. You want to walk out of me. What do you want me to do? Now I'm asking you what you expect me to do. Chicks, so, please, I don't. Those men you're going to sleep with. So they're sweeter than me. I um, need to go. I'll see you when I call you. Call me drunk. Don't you walk out of me. Please <laughs> stupid. Chicks. Choose. Choose. This is not Chooks changed completely. He became a, a different person. He, he turned to a beast overnight. I lost someone who I who I used to look up to as a father. Someone who promised me a bright future. I, I lost him to alcohol. You know, I, I would have stayed back. But the constant beating, the nagging, the fighting, the quarrels, everything. I had to leave. And then I met Mike. Stan Mecca, you know the rest of the story. Why didn't you relate to us when all this was happening? You see, Sister Helen, everything you've been through in Mike's house was as a result of the blood oath you took with Chips. Now the question is, Where is this chicks now? I don't know. Since I left that state, I haven't seen nor heard from him. But I can go back, I can you know, ask questions and, and, and try to find him. You must find chicks. The oath must be broken. Right, I love you, 
want from me now. I want you to leave me alone. Just leave me alone. I don't have any of your things with me anymore. You have taken my child. What else do you want? I beg, leave us. I, I, I look for one man. He named him Mr. Chips. He they stay here. Mr. Chips. Yes. There's no one by that name living here. No, I'm, I'm very sure. He lives here. I, I, I he lives here. I know. He, I know he lives here. Um, I'm, I'm new here, and and the tenant living here is also a new tenant, and it's possible he has moved out. Well, it's, it's, it's possible. I'm wondering if there's anyone that can actually take me to where he, live, he lives, his new place, I mean. Um, my, my second, you know him because he was the last, he was here when the last man moved out. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, please, is it possible? Help me call your second so that he can take me there. It's very important. Um, if you travel, I will not come back today. Maybe tomorrow, if you come back, he will direct you to where the man is. Uh, yes. Can I get his number? Ah, number? No, I don't have his number. Okay, no problem. I'll, I'll come back tomorrow. Yes. Thank you very much. Okay. Yeah. I am down your borders. You keep asking why me? Why me? Oh, let we come like fire. Burning down your borders. You keep asking why me? Um, sorry. Your face looks very familiar. Have, have we met before? Mm, I can't remember. Ah, <laughs> sorry. Um, I'm sorry. I've been while I'm here to see Mr. Chooks. Is he in? Yes, he's in, but who are you? Well, my, um, my name is Helen. I'm a friend of Chooks. Okay. I mean, he's, um, I used to be his very good friend, like his girl back then. Oh, yes, I, I, I want to see him, please. Okay, this way. Before he starts seeing the repercussion, Someone is here to see you. She said her name is Helen. Yes, you wanna prove yourself to your lover. Helen? Yes. Don't try blood coming at me. Yes, it's what you got into. But when the fire we stop burning, it's nice to see you too. Saviors and blood is so strong. We gotta look to you, Roji. Roji. Like fire. Like fire. Like fire. Like fire. Like fire. Hey! Mm. Oh. Mm. You're the one who caused the whole thing. How do you mean? You left me at the middle of trauma. Are you serious right now? I left you in the middle of the trauma. How? You were constantly beating me. I mean, I turned to your punching bag. You didn't see anything good in me. I wasn't supposed to stay back, was I? Anyways, let's just forget about that and look for a, a way forward. I mean, a solution to this. Only if the harbor 
will still be alive. Well, you can't know that until you try to find out. But I'm hoping he will. You know what? What is it? I still love you. Is there any way it can be reversed? Of course it can be reversed. Uh, provided both of you are willing, both of you agree to do it, it can be done. Just, then let's go ahead and reverse it. Yes, please. Yes, let's You're do ready it. Ready for it? Yes. yes. Okay. So where is the calabash? No, the calabash in which you seal the oath. Because with that calabash, it can be reversed. Without it, I don't think we can we, do anything about it. We, 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 we threw it away. Threw it away? What? Thinking that nothing will ever separate us. Yes. Why would you have done that? Why? Ah. Please. So, so, what's the way forward? What do we do? How? I mean, what do we do? You will have to come back in four days time. Eh? Let me console the spirits. They will give me the response that I will give you. Vivian, let me tell you what you do not know. That was a setup. Yes. How can you be telling me that somebody just walked into your home claiming that she and your husband were married before? But that's exactly what they said. That was a lie from the pit of hell. Yes. Look, I don't know at this point I am confused. I don't know what to do right now. Like, I'm so devastated. Uh, Vivian, Vivian. We've been friends for years and I cannot deceive you. Listen, you have to sit up and take charge of your home. Do not allow any woman to come and take what is rightfully yours. But the problem is Chooks has... Has suddenly said, mind me, I do not know what to do. What were you expecting at this time? To cuddle you like a baby? Come on, sit up. You know that woman is in that home. <laughs> God, God, just because I cannot be a child. Vivian, Vivian, Vivian. Just because I cannot be a child. Don't do it. Don't do it. Vivian, you know I hate to see this. If I see tears from your eyes, I will leave you and go back to you. God has failed me. I don't know what to do. <laughs> of these babies. Stop it. Just take the word the way you say it. Stop crying. I will. I will. Yes. I'll make sure no woman yes. comes into my home. Exactly. No matter what. Yes. Stop it. Okay. But, but Carol, what? What? Carol. There is no but. All I know is that no other woman will take charge of your home. No matter the intimidation. Come on, babe. Sit up. You cannot provide the calabash, symbol of the earth. Then uh, there is a way out of this situation. Oh. Oh. Thank you so much. And the way out is death. Huh? What? Of you. What? To what now? I think I'll have to explain this to you, my children. And listen very carefully. At earth. It's an old agreement between two people, two persons. This agreement or such an agreement can always at any point in time be reversed or recanted without any problem. But when an oath involves a symbol such as blood, that symbol must be destroyed at the point of destruction of such an oath or the captain of such an oath. Otherwise, one or both parties involved 
have to pay in their blood. Huh. But in this case, one of you have to give his or life to destroy this earth. And I will leave you to decide who amongst you will volunteer for this. What do we do? I don't know, I'm totally confused. Um, why so? I will do I, it. I, 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 I will do it. Do you do it? Yes, let me do it. Why? The people say, how to do it? Let me take the blame. My spirit will never rest. Find the land that I'm the one who cost you death. Uh, wise one, please don't listen to him. I, I will do it. I am going to do it. Just what are you doing? Let me take the blame. Can you just stop this? You are a woman and a man. I should take care of you. Just go and put yourself together. You don't have anything to lose. I don't have anybody to go back to. You have your mother, you have your sister. Why not go back to them? It doesn't matter. I am going to do it you for know, us. I caused this whole thing. I walked out on you. Now we are having these problems. You Let's walked out on me. Now I changed person that was why you walked out on me. Okay? Let me do it. Allow me to do it. Wise one. Wise one. Please. Go I'll, I'll go ahead and I will. I will. Wise one, I'm here. Just. I'll do it. Wise one, I'm prepared to do it. Then we'll do it together. Why don't we do this together? I am burning down your borders. You keep asking why me. Why me? Why would this be happening to me? I wouldn't have entered into such blood covenant with Helen. Come to think about it, I still love Ivan as it is now. When it seems like my world has crumbled, why will I leave Vivian and go back to her? What will the world say? I don't want to offend Vivian. She was there for me and I helped build me up when I was nothing. But come to think of it, either I go to Helen and bring her back as my wife or I die. What? <sighs> Even if you think from now till the kingdom come, it will not still change anything. You better go and sleep. Please put off the light when you don't think. I have told you to stop thinking, stop crying. Thank God you found choice. The ball is now in your court to decide if you want to go on with him, break the oath, or move on with your life. I can't. It's not possible for me to move on with my life, not in this condition. Sister, your life is highly involved here. You know, break the oath with him and be free with yourself. We have to do it together. That is the problem. Then, is he refusing it? He's not. The herbalist said we need to bring the calabash so he can reverse everything and, and set us free. Then go ahead with it. What's keeping you? Go ahead. It's, it's a problem. Which is. She's nowhere to be found. The 
Kabali said we must bring it so that he can reverse everything else will be in trouble. We threw the color bash in. Hey! You treated me. I am burning down your borders. You keep asking why me. Why me? Oh, let we come like fire. Burning down your borders. You keep asking why me. Why me oh? Got another advice for lovers Yes, you wanna prove yourself to your lovers There's so many ways to do that But don't try blood covenant You may not know what you got into But when the fire we start burning You can't even save yourself Blood is so strong you gotta watch it, watch it, watch it. Get we come like fire, burning down your borders. Why, why me? Let we come like fire, burning down your borders. Why, why me? Let we come like fire, burning down your borders. You'll be asking, why me? Maybe days or weeks or months or years before you start seeing the Young man, why are you searching for something where it cannot be found? The more you search, the more it vanishes. When the gold begins to play in the community of life, it seeks nothing but to devour. Go home and allow the spirit to rest. Go home. Go home. Go home and allow the spirit to rest. Mama, I'm thinking of something. Something like what? Jenny, my ancestors, is the next option for me right now. Yeah. You fear Clean your mouth before you commit the, the, your mention. How could you say me like that? Choose. Must you say everything that comes out from your mouth? Eh? Mama, instead of that, if everything Choose told us about Helen is the truth, then he should divorce Vivian and marry Helen as soon as possible. I as a person, I do not say anything bad about Helen. It's not that I, she abandoned my son when he was financially down. That's all. And Vivian refused to bear a child. Who knows if Helen would do otherwise? Right now, we are not talking about childbearing. What we are talking about now is battling with his life. This moment, that's all. That's my concern. Mama, all of them join. Yes. Childbearing and sickness, all of them join. You know, you should make a plan. You should make a plan and marry Helen as soon as possible. You should bring that in. That is the best option as it is now. That is what we are to do right now. <laughs> My sister, we shall do the need for you. We will pick a date while I discuss with my family members to know the way forward. Picking a date is not a problem here. The question is, have they decided to come back as husband and wife? That is the question you have to ask your brother while I talk to my sister concerning the same matter. I wouldn't have been here if I did not discuss with my brother. They have already discussed it. That's why I'm here. Okay, then. 
I will speak to my sister and then get back to you people. Okay. So when will I be expecting your call? Oh. Before the week runs out, you will hear from me. Okay. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. It's okay. Please talk to her. I will. I will. You will definitely hear from us. Okay. Thank you. If you don't want to embarrass me, go and undo what you did to my husband. Else I will slap you. It's like you don't know who I am. Please, I can't just leave my clothes for goodness sake. You are embarrassing me. What is the meaning of this? Oh, so I should embarrass you because you're a prostitute. You let her leave my husband alone. No, 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 have with your husband. Can you leave my place and I'm begging you peacefully? Okay. And I know exactly why I'm keeping quiet because if I choose to retaliate, you will not like me. Oh, you really? 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 I'm waiting for you. Really? 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 No one in this planet Earth will do that and walk away scot free. What does she think she is? She has taught the tale of the sleeping tiger. And whatever she says, she take. Sister, sister, please. I will advise we don't go into war with her. We don't have to mm, stoop so low. Mother Chooks would not like it. I'm just going to tender my complaints to him and let him take actions. Please. Tender Which shoes are you talking about? Tell me, which shoes do you want to tender your, your complaint to? Is it the one that is trying to survive? The one that is battling with life? What do you want him to do? I don't even know right now, but my head is so full. I, I'm confused. I don't even know what to think anymore. Well, why don't you go in and freshen up? Come and tell me how you're acting right. Sister, right now, I, 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 I don't know what to do with myself. I'm just caught between the devil and the deep blue sea. Okay, why don't you marry Juice? Since he's promised to... Yes, he said he's a changed person. Why don't you marry him? The sister just left here as well. Hmm? Yes. What did she come here to do? Of course, pleading. She was pleading we should fix it. You know, they want to officially come take you home. And? What do you want me to say? You have the final say. If marrying him is the only solution, then you go ahead and marry him. As for the reverse of the boat taking, I have somewhere I can take him to. Somewhere they can do it. Really? Yes, really. I will take him somewhere. I will take him to somewhere where they can do it. I am burning down your borders. You will why me. Why me? Oh. Let we come like fire. Burning. Sister, I want us to put that incident behind us. Mm -mm. I don't want any fight or quarrel. Let's just get what we came here for and live in peace. Biko. Mm -hmm. You haven't gotten enough of what I did to you the other day on the road. You have come to my house to face me. Have you? Eh? It is not you we are looking for. We are looking for you. And who is Chooks? My husband, I think. Look at her. Madam, in your village, did they not tell you that... Uh, 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 did they not teach you about uh, matrimonial mathematics? 
that one plus one is equal to one. Eh? You not carry your double left leg to my house all day. You are looking for shoes. Are you stupid? What are you talking You know what I do to you, daddy? I've been mean, disfigured your face. You haven't seen. Look, if I see the both of you, you are fine. Click my eyes, eh? Hey, hey, hey. You know what I can do? She can testify. I will slap and destroy your generation, idiot. Mother, get out. For yourself. Let me see both of you here. Rubbish things. Look at them, idiot. Did you see it? Did you see it? Since I don't want us to make problem. You don't want us to make Did you see how much you are insulting me? Oh, she don't allow me to see her. To, 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 to leave my anger on her. Sister, it's not you see me again. What is it? You mean she's talking to me that sister is okay? Don't worry, You want to use this opportunity that you don't know in your house to talk some senses into you. With the look of your health, you are going down to your grave every day. But God forbid, God forbid that my brother would die for the sake of one useless love I don't know. Mama has finalized your union between you and Henry. To see, whenever he sees or hears Henry's name, he becomes more lively. Mama, stop crying. Yeah, stop crying, you need a This is no crying matter. You have action. Action. Hmm. Take it or leave it. Eh? Helen must come into this house as chick's wife. And Vivian, you see that, that witch? Hmm. Her days are numbered. Mecca called me yesterday to tell me the, the kind of humiliation Vivian gave to them. <laughs> yeah. To this Hebrew. They came here. Yes, she came with Selene to see Chooks. That was when we were out. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? That wicked witch. Eh? <laughs> Mama? <laughs> you see this is beyond us. Yes. It's time for us to go and consult our elders. So they will not blame us at the end of the day. Ha! There's too little left now. There's too little. Best way out. Now we have to do that. Mama, stop crying. But this is yes, stop crying. always becoming better. Stop crying, Mama. <laughs> you have really spoken at length. He who has ears, let him hear. Mm -hmm. My daughter Vivian, it's not better for us to lose another soul because of our stubbornness. We all heard from Chooks that he took blood oath to Helen. And that's the reason we don't hear the cry of baby in this father. Well, that was what I was accused of. But God vindicated me. <laughs> Chooks did it out of infatuation, not knowing the outcome. And the only solution is for Helene to come back into this house as his wife. Yes. So what happens to me? Eh? What happens to me? Go back to your father's house. Yeah. You see, the blood oath forbids Chuk from marrying any other woman except Helene. Likewise, Helen cannot sleep with any other man except Chooks. So, uh, my daughter, whatsoever damages you have encountered while living with our son here will be made up to you. Eh? So, so that uh, Helen can come in as his wife as soon as possible. Mm -hmm. Chef Chef. Yes. Oh, I mean, I mean, I mean, Why is everyone quiet? Are we done with the meeting? Uh, we are waiting for you so that you can tell us when you will be leaving this house. Mm -hmm. So I should leave this house just like that. Yes. No, carry the property yes. and leave. Yes. Carry the property and leave. Look, 
I say that you are a very stupid and useless man. Yeah. Don't have to forget my elders. You forget? You forget me for I'm not your stupid! Uh, 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 you are repeating it. Yes! You! You are very stupid! Uh -huh. uh, yes, because, because Henning came with the whole unfortunate thing. Look, I am legally wedded to my partner shoes. Don't you get it? Or oh, because Helen came with uh, 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 her abortion. This is a proof that I have waited to him. We built this house together. Where was Helen when they made the oaths? When Chooks was a drunkard? I did everything possible. I loved on him. I have rejected him. If not God, if not God, that the foundation of the religion is useless like it is done. It's not something good, it's useless situation. And you are here talking more better than you leave this house because of this useless home with Henry. Don't talk when I'm talking. Don't get me angry. Hey. Yes, I'm okay. Hey. Hey. You went all the way hey. from, from the village, like what you were doing, to come and push me out. Even with me, high cost of transportation. You can't go push me out of my house. But let me tell you something. I love you. Don't go. Shut up. 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 Shut up.
I trust you. <laughs> I know what you can do. My darling, where are you going to? Do, do you mind me escorting you to shop right? Because I need to get some stuff. Why not? Okay, let's go. All right. My girl. Hey. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Baby. Our wife. There's nothing that will happen now that has never happened before. I understand the trauma you and my brother is going through right now. But please, I am begging you to have a rethink and come back to my brother. He still loves you. Are you actually telling me to come and live under the same roof with Vivian? No, it's not possible. We have a plan even at that. You know, the both forbids you and my brother to have anything to do with opposite sex, if not both of you. But think of where life is involved. What do you want me to say now? Just give us a go ahead, brother. Then we'll proceed with the marriage, marriage uh, rights and everything. And you'll see my brother well again. Really? So this whole time you've been talking, I mean, this whole preaching is about your brother's recovery and nothing more. No, no, it's not only for my brother. No, please don't misunderstand me. Hey, I'm, 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 I'm just saying for the restoration of the both families. Please just do it for me. Do it for my family. Do it for your family. Even for you. I can do it if you want to. No, 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 please, please. Sit down. It's your own house. Then make my mission fulfilled. Please. It's okay, I I'll think about it. I'll be thinking. There's nothing to think about. There is a lot to think about. I too, because I don't want a reoccurrence of my past experience. So please give me time to think about it. I hope we do not take time. Kirsten, since after the revelation of my sister's blood oath, things has never been the same with her. Sister Nega. Negative or positive? Negative, in Kirsten. She has been having sleepless nights, fighting with the truth's wife. I mean, so many things has been happening. Bad, bad things. Really? Well, I thought they reversed the blood oath. So I thought so. Until she told me everything that has been going on, they were asked to bring back the calabash so that they can do everything but unfortunately they threw it away so it's impossible to break the oath that's why the blood oath couldn't be broken but i bring you good news today sister America. there is nothing impossible with my god because he's the almighty god the rulers of the universe that oath is going to be broken by the Almighty God. That's the mm -hmm. yeah. I've seen worse cases than that, and the Almighty God solved it to His glory alone. I will give you some list of some spiritual items. Let's get to them and leave the rest to God and see God at work. He never feels. Thank you, Holy Spirit. <laughs> Cheer up, Sister Nega, this way. Young man, why are you searching for something where it cannot be found? The more you search, the more it vanishes. When the goal begins, to play in the community of liars. It seeks nothing but to devour. Time is ticking. Time is ticking. Time is ticking.
something like this happened in my life. It was like, it was like a movie. My sister invited her pastor and the prayer warriors. My dear, it didn't take any, it was just a matter of time. Everything changed. I was so surprised. Hey. Just like that. Just like that to my sister. No fasting, nothing, nothing. My dear, when they say God works in mysterious ways, that was what happened last week. Hey! Honey, I am happy that you have overcome this problem. I am happy for you. So, huh? I also pray it touches my brother too. It will. Okay? Are you sure? sure it will happen? My happiness right now is there is just this there's this change within me. I feel so new. I feel so so rich. There's this breath of fresh air that. My sister, you I don't know. I can see it. You don't need to. You don't need to explain. <laughs> I have seen it already. You are looking so, ah, so beautiful. Thank you, <laughs> my dear. So what now? Are, are we still carrying on with the marriage arrangements? Um, that would have to wait for now. My sister and I will be traveling to the village to see my uncle regarding. Mike's bride price, I mean the one he built on my head. Oh, okay. It has to be returned. Afterwards, I am free as a bride. Okay. I'm free to accept any suitor of my choice. That would be nice. <laughs> that would be nice. <laughs> Thank you. But we are coming for you in advance. <laughs> no problem. Meanwhile, hold on, I'll be back. Wise one, why is my own so different? We went hunting in the bush and hunt same animal. 
what my own ghost decided to be taken away from me. Why? The person I took an oath with is right there, rejoicing after deliverance. Why is my own different? I cannot speak for the spirits. Besides, decisions in this matter are yours to take. A wise one. Hmm? What do I do to appease the gods? To appease the spirit? Death! Human life. What? Of course. Blood. Swear. Good. Why don't I go ahead and do it? Because the life I'm living right now is meaningless. Yes. It's heading away that way. There is no need bringing her with me. That is wrong. Yes. And listen, both of you must be of one accord. She has to give her consent if you must go to the land of the dead to solve this problem. That is the way it is. And that is the way it is going to be. <laughs> they said there is light at the end of the tunnel. Very true. I'm happy you found it after all you've been through. I wouldn't have found that light if not for you and for God. I can't thank you enough. You don't know what you did for me. Trust me, if not for you, sis, I would have still been living in bondage. Thank you so much. God bless you for me. <laughs> it's okay. Um, now you have to choose from the suitors that is coming to you. If you don't want to marry, choose. Okay. I have that in mind, but first I need you to do something for me. Anything. It's jokes. Even if I'm not going to get married to him, I, I don't want to leave him like that. I just, I want us to look for a way out to, to, to help him. After all, we got into this mess together. Please. I am still listening because you haven't told me what you want me to do for you. I want you to help him. Let, let's take him to the same pastor you took me to. Please. If that is what you want. Huh. You're not supposed to be on planet Earth. You're just supposed to be one of those angels in heaven. Thank you so much. It's okay. I will do anything for you. <laughs> Thank you. All right. <laughs> Jane. Mama, good morning. Good morning. Ah, Jane, you don't look so good. What's wrong? Nothing, Mama. Just that I, I am feeling very tired and weak. I can see it in your eyes. You look dull. And... And what? Are you? Yes, Mama. The doctor confirmed it yesterday. <gasps> Hope nobody's up. Not even your husband. No. But I wanted to tell him this morning before leaving for work. But he was in a haste. End it there. Just kill it. Okay? Do not tell anyone. I want to do something for this one to stay. Hmm? A rat does not eat a person's food that is awake. I am your mother. I will have to do something this time. Make sure you don't tell anybody. Okay? Until I finish what I want to do. This is good news. 
This life no balance at all. This life no balance at all. Why is Helen doing this to me? After all the love we shared together. Vivian is the one chasing Helen away from this house. Because no woman in her right senses will come into another woman's house to ferment trouble. Mama, I've tried so much to push her out of the house. But the more I try to push her away, the more she stands strong. I think there's something somewhere that is making her to be this strong. And I believe that her another strong point is because we built this house together. Then let her take the house and you have your life. You will build another life, a house when you have life. Or you relocate to the village as far as you stay alive. Mama, it was, it was just a mistake. And then the mistake is still haunting you till date. You new generation children, you don't hear one, one bit. Going into blood oath does not mean you love each other so much. Mama, Mama I just said that. It was a mistake. Stop blaming me, please. And the mistake says you and Helen must get married. Else, one of you will lose his or her life. People came on and answered. I hope all is well. Net on, all is not well. My daughter, a frog does not run in the daylight for nothing. If he's not running after something, then something is running after it. You see, a loud noise in the midnight definitely is going to cause sleepless nights. And the mouth will not rest until it finishes what it's chewing. <laughs> Man, you want to finish us with proverbs. <laughs> A minute, please. <laughs> Hey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
what is happening here? You didn't even tell me we are coming. Eh? Hey, that will that will not do much. They eh? said a good friend is push me, I push you. Mm -hmm. Fall for me, I fall for you. <laughs> hey! Come on! You uh, just want to pay back my working okay, with okay. all this program. <laughs> <laughs> because you are the one. Hey! Thank you. What are you? My daughter. Hey. I thank you for the break. Mm. You've done well. Hmm? Thank you very much. So we will be talking while drinking. Yeah. Mm. You see, you people know us. Hmm? We are not strangers to you. And we are here for just one mission, which is to take back our wife, Helen. Uh, the mistake has been done already. But please, don't let us strike the sword according to the height of which we raised our head. I'm directing my speech to you, Helen. Please, I beg you, don't throw away the child with the beating water. This matter is supposed to be discussed in the village. But we cannot do that without your consent. We cannot beat a child and we ask the child not to cry. Is it possible? It's not possible. So, Biko, Ali, cry no more. No, 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 it is okay. Enough. Helen here is the center of everything. It's okay, Uncle. Thank you. you know, this is like a wound in the palm. <laughs> the pain resurfaces when you wash it again. Chooks and I went into this together. I want us to come out of it together. Nothing will happen to you. Thank you very much. You are indeed the true daughter of your father. I feel really Exactly. Thank you very much. I can do it now. I can do it. Please go ahead. Go ahead. Now, you're welcome. If I finish this one, this other for another one. Where are the people? My dear, do I know when they are moving from one place to the other just to push me out of this house? They are trying every means, doing everything possible for me to leave this house. Mm. I heard your sister fought in your own house. Yes, so hey, if it's me, our mouth won't be able to tell what our eyes would see. My dear, hey, I gave it to her. Hot, hot. Don't you trust me? I, I trust finished you. her. Hey. My dear, stand your ground. Do not allow them to intimidate you. For real. Me. Hey, hey, hey. Me, your husband. How about his health? Hope it's getting better. <laughs> My dear, how do you expect me to know when he is moving from one herbalist to the other? From one native doctor to the other? How do you expect me to know? Please, 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 let's just allow the dead bury themselves, eh? Mm. Please, what do I offer you? My dear, don't bother about me. I may not be comfortable to take anything here. When we go out, don't worry. <laughs> okay, oh. <laughs> You're looking good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. 
Mike, look at Mike, you. Mike, Mike. Yeah. Oh, where are you going? Why are you standing here? Um, just coming from my village meeting. So, why don't you attend our meetings these days, Mike? Oh, Uncle, I'm sorry about that, okay? Oh. Just uh, these days, I have a lot on my head. But I thought everything was over after my last visit to your house. What is it again, Mike? Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, look, a lot has happened, okay? Let's go to the car. Let me tell you. Mike. Uncle! Uncle, follow me. Come. Look at you! <laughs> you are <always> young. <laughs> ah. Uncle, easy, easy. Uh, yes. <clears throat> I'm not getting any younger. <laughs> but you don't want to get old. <laughs> so I'm out here, Mike. <clears throat> huh? Uncle, you know, um it's true that um Ellen allowed me to marry a second wife and that um she's no longer in my house. She left. She left or you threw her out of the house? Uh, well, you know, whatever. Uh, Uncle, I lost my child. But we consoled you then. You know, I... I know that um, you're not aware that Helen is responsible for the death of my baby. What? Yes. If what you just said is the truth, why didn't you inform us at the family meeting? So your brothers can go and see it to the end. Uncle, that's in the past now, okay? Uh, the reason I wanted to see you was to inform you that Jane is pregnant again. Ah, thank God. Uh, yes, thank God. Thank God. But my pastor wants me to collect the diary on Helen's head so that you'll be official that we're no longer married. So? So I want you to accompany me too to see the people on the death feast. Hmm, that's okay. That's okay. But you know there are so many things attached to these things. We will discuss that when we pick a date. Uh, no problems. Uh, no problems. Uncle, let me drop you. <laughs> I'm okay with whatever thing. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Uncle! <laughs> Everything is fine. You are the last person I expected to see here. Like you are chasing a cricket out of the hole. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I'm sorry. Hey, I'm sorry for not coming all this while. But I'm here now. What happened? <clears throat> are you aware your sister is no longer living with me? No, you're just telling me. What happened? Where is she? How? She she left my house and then. Go on, go on, continue. And what? Look, we, we had a fight. You know, we had a fight because um, I married another wife. You know, so she left my house and she never came back. It's been like a month. One month. <laughs> I am clapping for you because you're a real man. You married another wife without informing anyone. And your wife left your home for the past 12 months. You didn't tell anyone and you're just telling me now. Look, I, I know you have every right to be angry, okay? I'm sorry. So what do you want me to do? To go in search of her for you? I have information that she's staying here with you. You're still listening to rumors. At this millennium age, you are listening to rumors. Well, why are we going in search of her, okay? Why we keep searching for her? I want to go to her people and officially make it move. But I'm not marrying her any longer. And then. And then to perform necessary things that cause it to cost on the tradition. You will give us our daughter the same way we give her to you. I will not have this discussion with you. Mm -hmm. Have a good day, please. Mm -hmm. Have a good day. You will provide my sister the same way we gave her to you. Sim, 
sister. What is it? This one, your face is like this. What is it? Are you? Is everything okay? Didn't you see the problem on your way back? No problem. I did not see any problem. God forbid that I need any problem. I don't want to. I don't want to face any problems, please. But what exactly are you talking about? What do you mean? Sorry, problem. What's that? Mike was here earlier. I thought you saw him on the road. What? Who? Mike. Mike. What did he come here to do? What was he looking for? He was looking for everything. He said he wants to go to the village to announce that both of you are no longer together. Ah, voila, that makes it a perfect uh, combination. Because that's the same thing I want. Because we've been looking for a way to, you know, return his own bride price. Afterwards, I become a free lady, free as a bird, to do anything I want to do. It's not that cheap. I will not make it easy for him. I told him to go and return you the same way we gave you to him. Uh -uh. Uh. To that extent? Yes. <laughs> Someone that doesn't know the whereabouts of his wife for the past one month. My dear, that is the list of my worries right now. I have better things to think about. Right now, what I want to do is just go in there, have a clean, fresh shower, and come watch my favorite series. Okay? <laughs> I'll put a smile on that face and let that be just what you want to talk. Sincerely, I am bothered. I... I don't want anything to happen to Daniel. I love him very, very much. I'm just scared of saying yes to his proposal. I understand you. I can understand you perfectly well. But I still don't want you to miss this one. I mean, Daniel is a good guy. Yes. So, so what am I supposed to do? Say yes to him? Knowing full well the situation we have on ground. Four men in one month. What would people say if a fifth one comes on board? Sister, I don't want anything to happen to this young man. I don't, I don't want that strange spirit to follow him too. Okay, I, I will go see my pastor. Uh, I know that he must do something. He must have something to sister, do. Sister, you don't understand. This has gone beyond the past. It has gone beyond pastor thing. We, there is nothing beyond God. There is nothing God cannot do. I know my pastor. He will do it. There's nothing beyond God. So just calm down. We will go see him. There is nothing beyond God. Okay. We shall see. No problem. I have already mastered your strategy in this house. Instead of me to leave this house, you two should leave! You must leave this house! Useless thing! We shall see. We shall see! Yes! We shall see now! Are you not together? We shall see! The other day you sent your sister Lizzie! What happened? I am ready to fight everyone in this house! Try it! Tell me now! I am not marrying again, easy bite. Now my thoughts, Jukes! You must get married. Go now the day when I used to cry. Go now. Hey, hey. Now. Hey, hey. Vivian, I am ready to face every storm. You have not seen anything. This is how stupid you are. In fact, you have no reason of living in this house. You cannot produce anything. You're barren. You don't have a womb. Uh, yes. You see? I am stupid. I know I am very, very stupid. I will not cry. I will not feel bad. I don't have a womb. No problem. But you, a shameless man. That is why you go about and pay girls so that you will get them pregnant. But look at you, impotent man. You cannot even pregnant a woman. And you are kissing me, you slash thing. You are such a stupid and foolish person. Mm. Yes. Okay. Really yes. And you are a blood sucking demon. That is how you went around to start sucking Helen's blood. You think I don't know? You slash thing. Anyway, uh, you're just so stupid. You're foolish. Mm. I don't even have time for someone. Else. You're also foolish. Look at him. Where are you going to? Where? Hey, look at him. Go! No, I don't play you, you slept man. I'm like, pack up, pack up, pack up. Hey, let me see what you can do now. You can see the next of you for this one for this in this house. I will show you how best I am. Nonsense. Important idiot like you. Rubbish. Hey, look at him. Pack up, pack up, pack up. Rubbish thing. Doesn't even happen. 
Dennis, idiot! Barton, you're welcome. Please sit. How did we go? Yeah, the divorce paper is out, so I brought it for her to sign. Unfortunately, she's at her home. All the same, uh, you have to give her the paper. All she needs to do is to pin down her signature. That's all. Barista, I'm sorry I can't be able to do that. You can imagine the cover that came here. We sell her someone papers. She tore it before him. What? You mean a land woman like Vivian did that? That's outrageous. And she may go in for it. You see? Okay, nevertheless, you will have to give her this paper. Let her tear it. It's okay. Yeah. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Okay, I think I have to call it. Alright. Hey, this is not my be. Please help me ask God why me. Have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? Where did I go wrong? I, I, I should have just rejected it. I should have resisted the proposal this time. Oh. Ah. Okay. Mm. Need to calm down. This is not the end of the world. <laughs> this is the end of the world, oh, This is the end of my life. <laughs> this is the end of everything for me. Everything has ended. This is not look at me. <laughs> How do I explain to the world that five men, sister five, <laughs> all died one month, died mysteriously, just like that? <laughs> How do I explain? What do I tell the world? Have I been eating this men? Did I eat them? Where are they? You are telling me to understand. You are telling me it is not the end of the world. Sister, I am finished. <laughs> I am finished, sister. No, calm down. <sighs> you are gonna die on a road crash. It might not be what you're thinking. <laughs> because death is different from others. Sister, death is death. Oh. Death is death, no matter how. I don't, I, I don't even know how to explain this. Why, Why now? Why did he not die before the introduction? Why didn't something happen before the introduction? Why must it be after my introduction every time? <laughs> ah! Oh, okay. Mm. I'll go see my pastor in the morning. This is not a case of pastor. It is not a case of your pastor. <laughs> it is not. Oh, calm down. Calm down. Ah. Okay, I'm trying. Just calm. Oh, I'm trying to be calm. Oh, look at me. I'm just calm. I'm so calm. Oh, Jesus! 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 Oh, 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 oh. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Okay. okay, you can check it. I don't know. Someone brought it when you went out. <laughs> Divorce later. <laughs> Sign it. Don't this your cheap forgery.
of mere men goes and could not come back. You can say that again. Why? Look, Chief thinks that he can toy with me and go like that. No. I really dealt with him, including that charge and bail lawyer that parents himself are on him. I gave it to them. I have suffered in this marriage, and it is my turn to enjoy. You get it, points. Vivian, <laughs> you are still better than me. Yes. Sweetheart, don't curse yourself. Do you think that those in wealthy marriages are enjoying? Do you think that marriage is a bed of roses. No, it is not a bed of roses. Please. Let you don't, me. look, look, calm down. You don't need to believe what you see. A lot of them are going through hell. Seriously. You just need to calm down. Let me taste it. At least one month of misses and I will be fine. Come on. Carol, leave that matter. The sound of a bitter cola is different from the taste in the mouth. Please. You have to take life easy. Vivian, let me cry inside Lamborghini by smiling on top of Okada. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you say so, that's your wish. Baby, <laughs> I am lady. Ha. Anyways, before I forget, I will suggest you go home and inform your people of what you are going between your kids and me. You think so? Why driving at night? You know, it's very risky. <sighs> Brother, it wasn't my fault. Though. He's the driver. The man insisted that the bus would get filled before leaving. It's okay. That's normal. <sighs> She's fine. She sent her letters. It's okay. People just travel without thinking of letting me know. <laughs> Well, that is what you think. You're okay now, man. So I decided to go and help my mom with some family. Nice family season. Okay. <laughs> it's not bad. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll be okay. Yes, I'm good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I came to tell you that I'll be traveling to see my father first thing tomorrow morning. I think I'm talking to myself now. Mm -hmm. What are you telling me? Eh? I'm telling you for formality's sake. Mm -hmm. Baba, why do you go to answer this thing? Eh? Just for her to just leave us alone. Yeah. I'm sorry. Baba, please your hand. Any progress? Yeah, I'm, I'm working towards that. Really, really working towards that. You know what? Just go in for a question of eat, face, sleep. Tomorrow morning we'll discuss, okay? Welcome. Oh. One. Greetings, one. Greetings. When the eyes whip, the nose of necessity whips with it. Your cries has reached the ears of the spirits of the land. Chus was here last time to offer himself as a sacrifice. How about the spirit said no, because both of you need to be here with a unity of purpose for that to be accomplished. Um, thank you very much, wise one. We are really, you. really grateful. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, uh, so shall we proceed? Yes, wise one. Wise one. Um, 
we just wanted to let you know that um, we have decided to be t yes to be together. Yeah, we've decided to live together. Ah. Oh, in that case, may the girls of Allah bless your union together. You say, and then you may hold this. Come on, <laughs> take her home. You know, at the time I thought I was going mad. Mm. But thank God it came so quickly and intervened. You know, in the last years, I figured that no matter how fast you try to run in this life, you can never run faster than your shadow. Mm -hmm. And for every minute, I mean every second you spend on planet Earth, there is a lesson to be learned. Trust me, I have learned a lot. Hmm? Uh, come to think of it. What were you doing shakara for me? Uh -uh. Me doing shakara mm -hmm. for you? And who told you I, I was doing shakara for you? <laughs> <laughs> My love, I wasn't. I didn't just want to have the same experience I had at Mike's place. You know, living under the same roof with another woman as a co-wife. Where I was being treated like a slave in my own husband's house. And then having your wife around with you. And how did you manage to live with that woman? That woman is a lion that can devour you in two seconds. Her claws are like she just wants to. How did you live with her? Point of correction. My ex. Okay? Okay. And that was in the past now. She's coming back no more. Mm, and yes. you think she the can... court has settled us. Ah. Yes. And you think she cannot locate you here? No, she's gone again. She's not coming back anymore. Okay. If you say so, go see Wahala. Hmm? Meanwhile, I can see you're hungry. You haven't yeah. had anything since, so tell me, what do you want to eat? I'm ready to make your favorites. Do you know what I want to eat now? Um... Uh -uh, don't even open your mouth and say it. Don't, see, as I'm looking at you like this now, eh? Just seal that your mouth, don't open it, because I know what wants to come out of that your mouth. Okay, now that's really thinking, now that's in there. <laughs> <laughs> uh -uh, stop, uh -uh. I'm not joking. Okay, do you know what? I'm not joking. Why is it only your head? Only the inside your head is inside his bedroom, bedroom. That's what. Eh, eh. That's what I want. I'm not in the mood. That was what huh? you want. Hey! <laughs> Stop! I'm not joking. Come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh, 
the world is collapsing on you. What? You think I'll be better than the world has collapsed? You just can't Send us the fires of God. Just, just you do this one to me. Just you do it. Just, hey, I'm the beast. I'm the beast. You see what I'm talking about? Just grab everything in this house and chop this with it out for me. No, 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 no. Mom is heartless. Oh, Jesus. Ah! Ah! God, help me. Vivian, God, Vivian. Oh, see, at this point, see, look, listen to me, listen to me. Finished. At this point, you have to stop crying. <gasps> you just have to stop crying. Finished. Listen to me. You still have your life to live. And for the building, it's all yours. So what you have to do now is to be strong and start life all over. Okay, Vivian, please, you can do this. You will not understand. You will not understand. Oh, you will not understand. Good day, madam. Good day. How may we help you? Um, who among you is Vivian? Um, I'm Vivian. Is there any problem? You are under arrest for disobeying court order. What? What? Save that strength. When you get to the station, you will explain that. Move! Wait! Are okay. you trying to stop? Eh. Move! Carol! Carol! Are you not coming with me? I say move! Eh? Carol, don't move. worry. Just go. Uh, please. Move! I'll come and see you later. Okay. Move! No! Please! I want to take you! I want to take you! What is this? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you again. You're welcome, baby. You're the best. Me too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Now, you know what? You people are doing a wonderful work here. Give God the glory. And you people are going home today. Really? I so, have... so quick. I am being ready. Absolutely. I'll, I'll pick her immediately. Yes. I'll come you again. Hello? Who am I speaking with? Oh, Vivian. Is that you? Don't worry, I'll join you soon. So sorry, I've been busy. I foresee. What's that the reason you've been calling me with different numbers? Vivian, to tell you the truth, I don't think I'll be able to come down here. See Vivian, I don't want to put myself into any trouble. Yes. Abie, carry your cross. I should come down there and see you for what now? Am I a lawyer? Okay, I welcome everybody to this. Uh... I just want to thank God for my life and for the life of my beautiful wife here. You know, I thought my life was going to be something else. I, I mean, I thought I was going bad till she came back to my life and everything changed. And I want to thank everyone who stood by me when I was passing through all that, you know, through all that old taking stress and all that, you know, which was very brutal and very bad. 
for anyone to venture into. So I thank God that finally today we are back to the glory of God. And here is my beautiful wife here. She's the reason I'm leaving today. Yeah. And I will always love you. Today, she's pregnant for me. And she's going to deliver like the Hebrew women. Amen. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. You <laughs> need to have a grandson. <laughs> Mama. Yes. But before, before that, can we just make merry, eat, drink, where are they? Oh, yes, that's true. Every, yeah, everything is ready. Um, so, stand up. No problem. Before the train goes in. And don't test my grandson because I know it's going to be a son. Ah, no, my mommy, I want a girl. Ah, bow. I want a boy. A boy, boy please. My grandson. My grandson. Boy. Burning down your borders, you keep asking why me, why me, oh, let we come like fire. Burning down your borders, you keep asking why me, why me, oh. Got another vice for lovers, yes, you wanna prove yourself to your lover. There's so many ways to do that. But don't try blood covenant You may not know what you got into But when the fire we start burning You can't even save yourself Blood is so strong You gotta watch it, watch it, watch it It will come like fire It will come like fire Bye. Bye.